Hello everyone, I am Om studying in grade 9. Today we will see the difference between mass and weight. Many of you may get the question, what is the difference between mass and the weight or are they similar? So let us begin. So today we are mainly going to see six point difference between mass and the weight. This is the question in every exam, differentiate between mass and weight. So I guarantee you that after hearing this video, you will clear your doubt regarding mass and weight. The first and the most important part is the definition. You also get question in exam different differentiate or you may also get one mark or two mark question. Define mass or define weight. For one mark question, you can write answer. Quantity of matter in a body is called a mass. And for weight, you can write force by which earth attracts any object to its center. If it's, it is for one and half mark, you can add an example for both. Now second point. We will differentiate between mass and weight on the basis of quantity. You may know that there are two types of quantity, scalar quantity and vector quantity. First, let you understand what is scalar and what is vector quantity. A sc scalar is a quantity that is fully described by a magnitude only. And vector quantity requires magnitude as well as direction. So these are the basic things. You may know this. Now mass is considered as a scalar quantity. And weight is considered as a vector quantity. You can find answer to the question why mass is considered as scalar and weight is considered as vector. Let us begin to the next point. Now we will see the difference that mass of a body is constant everywhere in the universe. Now this is the most important point that mass remains constant everywhere. You may go on the earth, moon or in the space. As it is matter present in a body, so it can't be changed anywhere. So this is the important thing about mass. And when we differentiate it with the weight, weight of a body varies from place to place. So it may be vary as it is the gravitational force acting on an object. The force of gravity is diff different on earth, moon or in any part of the world. So weight varies from place to place and it may become zero when there is no gravitational force. But mass can't be, can't be zero anywhere. Now we will differentiate weight and mass on the basis of their formula. The formula to find the mass is force divided by acceleration. This is the formula used to find the mass. You may remember it very easily. The formula to find weight is mass into gravity. This is also an easy formula and you can remember it in few seconds. The next point of distinguish is mass can be determined by an ordinary balance. This is a point which tells you that mass can be determined by an ordinary balance. We can use an ordinary balance to determine mass. Weight of a body is measured in spring balance. But when it comes to the weight, we require spring balance to measure the weight. And the next important point is SI unit of mass is kilogram. SI unit which is called as System International which is used worldwide. The standard unit is kilogram. So wherever you go in the world, the mass is measured in kilogram. And the unit of weight is Newton. But we can see in the market, everywhere on the packet, it is wrote that weight uh, 1 kg, 2 kg, 3 kg. So you can say that they are writing the wrong thing. The unit of weight is Newton, but the unit of mass is kilogram. So this is the sixth point between the difference. 
you may easily answer the question of difference and also the definition so these are the points we have discussed in this video thank you for hearing me